the man who didn't shoot Hitler, Henry Tande. That man came so near to killing me that I thought I should never see Germany again, the Nazi dictator allegedly told Chamberlain. As Hitler put it, the soldier had pointed his gun at him but spared him at the last moment. On September 28, 1918, one of the most shocking incidents of World War I is said to have taken place. During the Fifth Battle of Ypres, near the French village of Marcoing, the British soldier Henry Tandy displayed heroism that earned him the Victoria Cross. That, along with other medals, helped make him the most decorated British private of the entire war. But during this same battle, Tandy allegedly made one decision that altered the course of history. When the 27-year-old private saw a wounded German soldier in his line of fire, he decided not to kill the man. This one act of compassion would forever overshadow Tandy's impressive military record. British Prime Minister Neville Chamberlain would be the first to hear about this dramatic story from a man who claimed that he was the German soldier that Tandy had spared. That man's name was Adolf Hitler. Henry Tandy was born on August 30, 1891, in Leamington Spa, Warwickshire, England. His early years were tough and he spent at least part of his childhood in an orphanage, according to the Leamington History Group. Though some sources claim that Tandy joined the British Army when he was just 14, records indicate that he was actually 19 when he enlisted in 1910. When World War I broke out four years later, in 1914, Tandy soon made a name for himself as a courageous soldier who was eager to fight in the First Battle of Ypres. Though he was later wounded at the Battle of the Somme and then injured again at the Battle of Passchendaele, he refused to give up. Then, in 1918, as the Allied powers took the upper hand in the war over the Central Powers, Tandy showed heroism that remains legendary to this day. Perhaps most notably, he helped the British successfully capture Marcoing, an act that would earn him the Victoria Cross for conspicuous bravery. He was also awarded the Military Medal and the Distinguished Conduct Medal. If you like this video, make sure to subscribe to my channel.